a psychological operation. Psyop being that breaking up a couple typically involves strategic manipulation of emotions, perceptions, and interactions to create discord between partners. Such operations can be carried out for various reasons, including personal vendettas, manipulation for one's benefit, or even social experiments. Here's an expanded explanation of how this might be orchestrated. Understanding the target. Gather a target. Gather a target. Gather a target. Understanding the target, understanding the target, would start by collecting detailed information about the couple, their relationship dynamics, vulnerabilities, communication styles, and individual weaknesses. This can involve social media stalking, observing interactions, or silently questioning one partner about the other. Recognize it. Recognize it. Recognize it. Recognize that existing conflicts or insecurities can help tail the psyop. For example, if one partner has trust issues, this can be exploited to sow doubt. Intrusive interference. A common method is the introduction of a third party who could become a potential romantic interest for one partner, either directly or indirectly. This could be a friend or a new acquaintance who deliberately flirts or creates intimacy. The psyop might involve discreetly spreading rumors about one partner's fidelity or intentions. This to create jealousy and suspicion leading to mistrust. Manipulating social dynamics. The perpetrator might try to isolate one partner from their friends and family using tactics such as gaslighting or portraying the partner as unsupportive or jealous, which in turn can cause emotional strain. The psyop may play on the insecurities and fears of the individuals involved. If one partner has insecurities about their worth, the psyop can exacerbate these feelings through negative reinforcement or praise directed at the third party. Creating conflict for a party. Creating conflict in a third party. Orienting arguments or misunderstandings can lead to heightened emotional tension. The instigator might plant seeds of doubt or actively encourage conflicts to fragment the relationship. Feeding innocence. Throughout the operation, the perpetrator often maintains a facade of being a supportive friend or neutral party, allowing them to sow discord while shielding their actions from suspicion. This involves making one or both partners question their perceptions or feelings, contributing to a breakdown in communication and trust. If the previous tactics create sufficient strain, the couple may reach a breaking point where they decide to separate. The instigator may encourage this final decision by presenting themselves as a comforting confidant during the breakup. Once the relationship has been broken, the perpetrator may either step back to reap the benefits of the created chaos or continue to manipulate one or both individuals, ensuring the cycle of emotional instability continues. It is crucial to note that engaging in such psyops is immoral and can have severe emotional and psychological repercussions for the individuals involved. Relationship strain can lead to mental health issues, long-term trust issues, and emotional trauma. Ethical considerations underscore the importance of honesty, communication, and respect in handling interpersonal relationships. Manipulating someone for selfish reasons is inherently damaging and can have lasting consequences. Ultimately, understanding the methods and implications behind such manipulative tactics can serve as a warning against their use and an encouragement to foster positive, healthy relationships instead. 